Hello, fellow video creators and video trimmers. If you're here, it's because you want to have successful video creations. The best way to do that? The ultimate video trimmer. Wave.video's variety of video editing features. These features include cutting, splitting, trimming, and emphasizing the important words in your video. And most recently, using brand new cutting edge technology, text-based video editing. For example, with Wave's brand new edit with text feature, you can remove all your filler words in just one click. I will take you through a quick tutorial on the video editing process on Wave's platform. At the end of the video, you will get to see an example YouTube sponsored ad where we are able to use Wave to transform the video. Stay with me till the end of this video to watch this in action. Considering that all video editing for Wave does not require downloading software, I am just going to type in the website name into Google right here. And it will bring me right to the home page. After you have signed up with an account, where pricing varies from free to business level, you will click on the My Projects button in the top right corner of your screen. Then, assuming you have your video downloaded on your computer, you will click the Upload Video button right in the top center of your screen. Select a video from your downloads. The selected video will appear at the very top of your My Projects tab screen. Once you click on your video, you'll be brought to this screen and you can click the Edit Video button. This will bring you to the editing homepage, which may look complicated, but you will see in just a moment how intuitive this platform is to use. On the bottom of the screen, we have tracks, or different parts of our video. Examples of these are your videos visual, audio, text, or captions. On the left-hand side of the screen, there are all the different possible tabs that serve as settings, categories, or add-ons that you can customize in your video. If we zoom in, you can currently see we are in the Edit tab. In each of these tabs, there will be a more detailed pop-up with all of the features and options listed for them. These are all accessible on the right-hand side of the screen. Now that you have a basic understanding of the format of the video editing platform, let's play with the most basic manner of trimming, trimming the end of your scene. If your video had a rocky end to it, you can easily take it off by selecting the tiny blue tab or holder right here. You can drag and drop on whatever parts of the video you would like to omit. For example, I'm going to stop it right at 156, getting rid of everything between 156 and two. But do not fret, if you omit too much using this method, you will still be able to drag it back in the other direction and recover everything you might have lost. However, clearly, this is only working for the end of your video. What if you want to cut something out in the middle or the beginning? For that, I am first going to decide which timestamp I would like to cut the video at and split the video into two. To do that, I am going to select a time with my playhead, which is this black line you see right here, and this will be where my video will be cut. However, to cut it, I will need to select the split scene button, which we can see on the bottom left hand corner of the screen right here. After clicking on the visual track and the split scene button, my one video has now been split into two separate scenes. Now, let's say I want to cut out the middle. I'm going to select one more time, let's say 148, put my playhead there, click my split scene button, and there we have our own separate scene right in the middle, which I can completely omit using the delete button, which is found right here. Using this manner, I can cut my video as many times as I would like. Now, let's get into a bit more detail on how to trim video using the trimming video feature. On the right hand side, we'll scroll down a little bit and there is the trim button, which if you zoom in, is right here. I'm going to click this, which will bring me to this scene. Here, I will only be able to watch this specific scene and more easily watch the part that I'm editing out. It is still the same manner of dragging and dropping unwanted parts away from my specific scene. 
Though these features are amazing for video trimming, our customers wanted to be able to see the text that is associated with the part of the video being trimmed. Connecting the text with video trimming allows for convenience and precision. Therefore, we are introducing our new Edit with Text feature, which we can see if we scroll down with this button right here. This new Edit with Text feature is a creation of text-based editing. It will bring us to a new screen where we can generate our transcript. Our platform will generate the transcript of your video in any of the languages in our collection. And if you need some more support, you can click to the How It Works button on top right here. After I've clicked my Generate Transcript button, I have my entire transcript generated, and now I'm going to select a portion of this text that I don't particularly like. Let's do right here. Seeing as I don't like it, I'm going to click the Trim button. As you can see on the right-hand side of your screen, this part is completely blurred out and will transition seamlessly between the two wanted sections of text. Now let's say I would like to completely restore everything I might have trimmed. To do this, I'm going to click the Restore All Strike Through button on top. Another useful feature is the Remove Filler Words button right next to it. This allows for the convenience and immediate removal of all the pesky parasite filler words that might have stuck throughout your video. And you don't even have to do it by hand. Now, let's say I would like to do the opposite of omitting. Instead, let's say I want to emphasize a certain word or phrase, like life-saving, world-saving, and animal life-saving. I'm going to highlight this section and then pick one of the three highlighted colors. This will show it as highlighted in this screen, but once we go back to our original editing homepage, it will allow the selected portion of our text to be a highlighted caption, provided we want captions in our video. Lastly, to confirm all of my edits, I'm going to go to the bottom right of my screen, click Add Captions to Video, and Save Changes button. Apply to the scene. We are currently on our captions track, and if we scroll to the selected part of life saving and world saving, we can see highlighted captions, allowing the phrase to be subtly emphasized without requiring much effort. Now, as mentioned before, I'm going to show you a quick before and after of this video. Like, specifically, you know, like the water. As we can see in the before edit section, it was full of awkward phrases, pauses, and words that I definitely did not want in my video. Walmart, we can find the best trinkets. So today I'd like to talk about the Brita. In the post edit version, I have seamless transitions with only the necessary words. As you can see, Way Video's platform allowed an intuitive, easy platform to improve my video tenfold. Well, there you have it folks, an entirely new method of video editing, the ultimate video trimmer. Using this, I brought my video to the next level by keeping it efficient and cutting out everything unnecessary. And I know that using Way Video, you can do the same. If you liked this, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and most importantly, follow the link in the description to begin using the ultimate video trimmer yourself. Have a good day.